Alrighty. Welcome back to Heavy Rain. That was some heavy, heavy stuff. Not gonna lie. Apparently now we get the, uh, the credits introduction. Curious. Rather curious. Pascal Langdale. Whew. Wow, I, that, that's really, uh, that is a pretty, pretty, um, demanding scene, I guess, jeez. <sighs> uh, I'm not quite sure why the game's called Heavy Rain, maybe it's because it's raining all the time. That could be a reason, and maybe, like, the rain is, like, in an extreme amount, there's, like, lots of it. Hence, heavy rain. Oh, jeez, okay. Zoom right in on people's faces. This just showing me all the different people who are affected by the, the heavying rain. Or maybe it's just like... It's just an excuse for David Cage to show off his amazing face technology. That man has a fucking obsession with face technology. Did you see the PS4 event? Oh, Guillaume! Guillaume's a cool name. Hashtag RFN. Um... Yeah, yeah, David Cage and, and faces, just it's one of those those things that he just like likes. He's like, with the technology, we will be able. No, he's not German. He's French. He's like, no, no, way, way, avec la technologie, we will be able to use the pixels to create much more emotion, because emotion comes from the pixels, which I do not agree with whatsoever, purely because I've played the Walking Dead game, the Telltale Walking Dead game, not Survival Instinct. Fuck Survival Instinct. The Telltale Walking Dead game doesn't look very good at all, visually. If you're looking at it from a purely graphical standpoint, it's not impressive. It's got a cool art style, but from a purely like technological point of view, no. Not at all. However, it is one of the most emotional games ever. Two years later, really? So Jason died? He's really dead. And now we're on the street with a beard. What the hell happened? Did we get divorced? Did, did Sean grow up to be like an evil, an evil kid? No, Sean's still alive. Poor old Sean. Hi, Sean. No brother okay. anymore. What a shame. Well, I guess we'll just drive you home, buddy. How about that? Um, maybe get in the car. That would be nice. Uh, oh, there, oh, oh, can I? I have this feeling that they'll just wall me off from exploring anywhere, because this is a very story-based game. All right, what do we do when we're in a car? Okay, first of all, we put our seatbelt on. It's the first thing, obviously. Then what do we do when we're in a car? We... Uh, turn on the engine. Uh, then we... Adjust our mirror. Actually, we should have adjusted our mirrors first. Damn it, we failed our test. Damn it. <laughs> should adjust the mirrors before you turn on the engine. Alright, now... Start revving up. There we go. Into gear, revving up. Okay, so let's say I got 90% on my, on my driving skills there. That was alright. Fucked up the windscreen, damn it. I mean, the, uh, the screen, the screen, wind, wind. The little mirror, dash mirror. Written and directed by David Cage, as I've mentioned multiple times already. David Cage. I'm kind of, uh, very interested in his new game, Beyond Two Souls. It's funny how you say his new game. It's like, it's like people like Ken Levine and David Cage. And, and fucking Shigeru Miyamoto, like you refer to the their games, but like teams of people worked on these games, whole teams. They get all the credit, all of it. I guess it's cool to have like, you know, recognizable figures from developers, but still. What is, oh, it's a cartoon. Oh, better not get copyrighted for this. Fucking copyright. Sean. Oh no! Is this our, this is not our house? 
This is totally not our house. We've totally got divorced. That's totally happened right now. I'm calling it. Oh, god damn it. Can we look at our fucking menu? Snack, homework, dinner, bed. Do you really have to write that down? You really have to write that down. I guess he must be divorced because only a man on his own with no idea what to do with a child would have to write that down. Uh, what have we got in the fridge? Um, A beer? Fuck it. It's been a long two years. We need a fucking beer. Let's, uh, let's drink up. Down it. Down it. Down it. Down it. Down it. Yes, my son. You deserve that. You really do. It's been tough. A bit more. A bit more. We need to drown these sorrows. Drown all the sorrows. All of them. All of those sorrows. Right, that's enough. We're done. You're not having any more. Put it back. Put it back. Okay. I don't think we really need to take a seat. What should we do over here? Should we take a seat in that chair? Have a look at the time. Yeah, time's getting on here. Almost five o'clock. I should probably keep an eye on the time because I need to know what to do with Sean. I think I've missed his snack. Because it's, it's supposed to be 4.30 as his snack. Damn it, I've missed his snack. This, see, this is why I need the board. This is why I need the board. Because otherwise I wouldn't know what I'm... Oh no, time is passing fucking quickly. We're in like a time warp here. Uh, shit, what's next on the list? Okay, what's next on the list for Sean? Um, homework. Okay, Sean. Uh, we need a snack. Alright, first of all, go to the fridge again. Can we not open the fridge? Damn it. I lost my one opportunity to feed my child. My only child. What is this? It's a teddy. It's a green teddy. Alright, let's check the laundry. Everything okay in there? Well, the laundry seems to be fine on its own. Uh, let's pick up the paper. What the fuck? Pick up the paper, dude. Have a look. What's this? Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Seven victim identified. The police have confirmed that the modus operandi is indeed that of the origami killer. Oh, jeez. This is scary. I don't like where this is going. Oh, he's in the loo. Alright, Sean. Time for... Um... Yeah, you just sit on the couch. It's fine. You're not going to have fun in games anymore? Can you not have fun in... Oh, god damn it. Can I watch the TV? Sorry, Sean, and Damn it. Well, interesting stuff going on on the telly right here. Copyright! Cannot have for longer than... Oh. Oh. Uh... Snack! Snack! Yes, you need a snack. Okay, there we go. Go on, get a snack. Okay, there we go. Okay, what time is it now? Fuck, it's like... Um... 5.30, okay. That's fine, you can get a snack. Oh, careful, Sean! Careful! You don't want to fall down, do you? What do you get? Crisps? It's not the best snack. Could have chosen, like, broccoli. That would have helped you grow strong and bones. Strong and bones. Okay, go on, eat your snack. Go on, have a chill out. That's fine. I'll, I'll keep an eye on the clock until 6. But at 6, mister, you're going to have to do your homework. Whether you like it or not. Alright, I'm gonna sit down. We'll just chill for a bit. Can I sit down? Please? You want me to sit down? No? Apparently we're not allowed to sit down next to Sean. Oh shit, Dad, no, don't turn... turn it off? It was my favorite show. Turn it back on, Dad. Alright, uh, uh, sure. Alright, alright, I'm sorry. S sorry. It didn't mean to turn it off. I'm sorry. I'll watch it with you. How about that? How about we have some uh, father-son time? Good old pirates. You have to wonder. Is, I'm not even sure if this is an actual show that they've got the copyright to. Or if they've just made a cartoon for the sake of Heavy Rain. Because that would be really cool. Oh no, pirates. No, he cut his eye patch off. Oh, it has the treasure. It has the hidden map. 
Oh, Sean! Maybe you one day will be a pirate and grow up big and strong. Like your father. Okay, I'm done. I, fuck kid shows, they're boring. I want to watch manly shit like Top Gear and things. Alright, what time is it now? Oh shit, it's time for you to fucking do your homework. You're fucking slacking off now. Sean, Home you want to do work. your homework now? Please, Dad, let me watch TV a no. little longer. No. We'll do it later, okay? No. No. You're doing it now. You should just get right to it. Then it's yes. done and out of the way. Yeah. Now get your bag and get set up in the kitchen. Come on. I'll help you. I'm not taking no for an answer, Sonny Jim. Come on, get your stuff. We're gonna do maths. X equals Y plus three. What is X equal? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, come on. Take a seat. Take a seat. Any seat. You can choose. I'll let you choose, and I'll take the second option. Whichever one you want. I don't mind. Okay, let's sit down. No, 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 no. Move. No, no. I want to sit down. I wanna, all I want to do in life is sit down. Alright? There we go. Right, now what do you got to do? What, what are your sums? You need help, buddy? This is really well done. Just from a pure story and cinematic perspective, it's, so far I've been extremely impressed with the game. And to a degree, you, c you can't argue that Heavy Rain isn't necessarily a game, because everything you do is kind of quick time event-ish. But it's all within context. So it is interesting from that perspective. But um, yeah, it, it's an argument to be made about, you know, what, whether you can even like call this a game, but there is interactivity and and you make your decisions. Like I could have made a decision to say no. You can you can do whatever you like. You don't have to do your homework. Dad, I'm finished. Can I go watch TV? Yep. Excellent. Good job, kiddo. You can go watch TV now. You can you can go. You can leave. I'm not um uh ill grace dinner. All right, let's. Take a look at the clock first of all. What time is it now? It is quarter to seven. Let's have um. Should we have early dinner? No, we'll it's have dinner early time. dinner. I better we'll have make something dinner. for Sean. Yeah, you better do. Oh shit! Yeah, it is quarter two. Better make something. What are we gonna make? The, the fridge is out of food. Let's go to the desk. Desk, the kitchen. Go to the kitchen. Um, microwave dinner. Sean, you right with that? No? Uh, Sean, what do you want for dinner? Um, oh god, what am I gonna make? I haven't decided yet. God, there's nothing in the house, Sean! Can't eat dinner if there's nothing in the house! God damn it. What do you want? Let me have a look. P you already, Pretty you already good. finished. Well, looks like you're done. <laughs> oh, okay, I just had go. to check. All right, off you go. Um, now we make dinner. Yep, it's dinner time. Come on, open the d door, door, the fridge. Hurry up, Sean. Jeez, wasting my life over here. Go chill by the tally. I'll try and make dinner. Um. Where's the supply? Is it in here? Maybe I should go in here. Is there anything in here for dinner? Should I switch the light on? There we go. Much better. Oh, right. Let's have a look at food. Um, apparently nothing. Apparently nothing, food-wise, is able to be made. Maybe I should have used the fridge earlier. It's called past seven now. God, it's... <sighs> I'm really bad with this time management, with trying to feed my child. I know I made fun of the list earlier. I know I made fun of the list, okay? But I'm going to have to send my, my child to bed hungry because I can't find... Well, all he's eating is crisps. And crisps is not a good diet for a growing young lad, so... What am I even supposed to do? How do I? There's nothing I can do, is there? 
Like, what if I go upstairs? I feel like upstairs is like ominous. It feels really foreboding up here. This isn't the same house, is it? No, it's not. It's certainly not the same house. Alright, I don't think there's anything to be done up here. Certainly nothing that can help me feed Sean. So that's fine, I guess. I guess we're just gonna tell him sorry, there's no dinner. Come on, uh, Sean. No? No, 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 it's not time to go to bed. Oh, but I never go to bed this early. Yeah, yeah, bad idea, bad it. We'll go to bed later. You're right, it's later. still early. Yeah, it's oh, still early. I'll come back okay. for you when it's time. Okay, um, we're going to go for gra Grace or no, no, I want dinner. Dinner, dinner, dinner. Do you dinner. want me to get your dinner? Oh, yeah, I'm really hungry. Yeah, you would okay, be. I'll it's go see what I can find. Well past your feet. I'll call you when it's ready. Feet time. There we go. There we go. All right, we just had to talk to him about dinner. Okay, what are we going to get? Uh, I think we'll give him roast chicken. That seems like a good, healthy, good, healthy food. Uh, what's that? Uh, no, we'll close. We'll close the fridge. All right, how do I make my roast chicken? Do I put it in the microwave? Do I... Yeah, we'll put it in the microwave. That's what I'm talking about, microwave dinners. That's how we eat in this family. All right, how long is it going to take? Fine, I'll just... Oh, that was quick. Jeez! Time moves fast when you're roasting chicken, I guess. All right, it's hot. It's hot. We need some plates. Let's get some plates out. All right, go grab the plates. There we go. Yeah, that's good enough. That's good. Sorted. TV dinner. Oh. There we go. Got it all on the plate first time. Into the sink. That's how we live our life. You can come uh, now, Sean. Your meal is ready. Come on, Sean. Dinner time. Oh, it means you're going to have to go to bed a little bit later. Pushing the boat out here. Go on, eat your food. All right, let me check the time. Five minutes. You got five minutes, young man. I know it's my fault you're getting dinner late, but you have five minutes to eat your food, or there will be consequences. There will be major consequence. All right, let's sit down and join him while he eats. Well, at least he has carrots. It's better than giving him the pizza that was there. I feel because there's veg built in here. You got your carrots. You got your potatoes. You got your chicken. It's all good. It's all good. This is this is a a much different life though than what what they were at two years ago. A very different life. You can tell all this music is really atmospheric as well. Extremely telling of the mood. His face is like a blank expression. You could say it's down to poor animation, but I would say that it's down to good animation. Really, you're gonna throw all away your vegetables? Well, Sean, it's now it is time. It's time for it's time for bed. It's time. It's time for bed. Go on, sit down, and then it's time for bed. Sit down. All right, now it is. Sean, it is time to go to bed. Come on, Sean. It's time for bed. I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a little longer? <sighs> Fine. Right, we'll wait a little before going to bed. I'm, de I'm a dejected dad. Mother, okay? I'm role playing here. Oh wait, her, the mother is still alive. It's twenty past eight. All right, I'll give you till half past. All right, half past, half an hour. We'll just stare at the clock until half past. No, we won't. That's boring. Let's, let's stare at the lamp. Much more interesting. Or just stare at me. You can do that as well. I'll sit down. What's up, buddy? I think that we can discuss something. So, do you want to talk a little? Talk about what? I don't know, about you, your friends, how things are going. Nothing special. So sad. So dejected. Well, I guess it's time to go to bed, buddy. Come on, Sean. It's time for bed. I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a I already more? let you stay up an extra ten minutes. You have now, to go. Now, that's not very reasonable, is it? You have school tomorrow. Yeah. I have to get some sleep. Eight thirty. He's right, pushing the boat I'm out. Going. Are you coming with me? Go brush your teeth and put on your pajamas. I'll come up. Off you go, buddy. 
Well, I guess our chart did help us in the end. Somehow. I'm not quite sure how, but it did. <sighs> Alright. What do I want to do before I go to bed? Maybe I should uh, go outside and stand in the rain for a bit. The heavy rain. Just think about, contemplate life in this horrible backyard again. Throw some basketball. R1, alright. Alright, ready and primed. Okay. Oh. Oh, god damn it. Cl oh, that was close. Damn. Alright, let's try again. Alright, let's try. Here we go. L1. Alright. Yes, come on, come on, that's got to go in. Yes! Solid. Good basketball here. Alright, let's put it down. I'm done playing basketball for the day. I'm done with that. Let's just go back inside now. God, it's such a horrible day. So, so standing out in the rain, dejected, and feeling terrible. I hope someone didn't steal Sean, because then we would have no children. That wouldn't be good, would it now? Of course it wouldn't. Alright, let's turn on the light so we can actually see what we're doing. That would be nice. And let's go into... Turn the light on here. Let's go into this bedroom. Oh, this is the bathroom. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll go to the loo. We need the loo right now. It's been a while. It's been two years since we went to the loo. I mean, you got to think that a guy would really need to go for a, a while if it's been two years since he'd gone to the loo. Right, what's it, what's here? Wash our hands? Yeah, might as well. We were, we were dealing with some chicken earlier on. It's always good to wash the hands of chicken. Good, good, good move there. Good idea. All right, let's go tuck Sean in, put him to bed. Shawnee. Shawnee boy, Shawnee buddy boy. Good night, Sean. My teddy. I haven't got my teddy, Dad. All right, we've got to go left again. It somewhere in the house. I know where that is. Where no, Dad. Please, I can't sleep without him. Okay. All right, I will I'll go do the fetch quest. It, okay. Time for the fetch quest. I wonder where the teddy could be. It could be anywhere in this whole entire house. I just do not even know. Where? So let us try and find it, because that would make my son better at sleeping. So let's go get it. There is the teddy. Let's take it upstairs. He loves his teddy. His green teddy. How old is Sean? I guess he's supposed to be like... Well, if he was like 11, that would be a bit weird with the teddy, but I'm not judging! If you're 11 and you're using a teddy, be my guest. Not not me to judge you. I'm just going Thanks, by the Dad. norms of society. Good night, Sean. Night. Dad? Yeah? Why do you look so sad? I think I just need some time. To get back to the way things were. You know, Dad, what happened to Jason wasn't your fault. Good night, Sean. Oh, jeez. He still needs time. Two years have passed, and he still needs time. It's tough, man. It's tough. Alrighty. Uh, I guess I'll tuck you in or something. It's probably a good idea. Put that blanket on. Don't want you to get cold at night. Put a pixelated polygraphic polygraphic uh, circle. There we go. We're all sorted. Let's go downstairs. Oh, what the fuck? 
What? The hell? What is going? Oh god. Um. Um. Uh. Uh. Oh shit. Oh shit. He has an origami. Is he the origami killer? I don't know. I don't know what's going on.